Hey, what is up and welcome to a brand new episode of It's Elementary where we take elementary school lessons and subjects and we break them down. We break them down in a way in which everybody can understand. Rather you are four years old or 40 years old, we're sure you'll be able to understand it or at the very least will make you smile, will make you laugh. If you haven't checked out some of our previous episodes, go take a look at them because sometimes I go look at the archive and I got to tell you, it literally blows my mind just what we're going over. Wait, excuse me. What? Hello? Uh -huh, it's your mama, boy. Hi, mom. Hi, yeah. How you doing? What you Wait, mom, I got you on speaker. Yeah, yeah, am I on speaker? Look, look. Yes, look. mom. Look. Huh? And I got a few things Wait, to but say. I'm I'm actually filming. I'm not no, sure no, how you don't worry about that. Okay. Listen, you said literally blows your mind, and that ain't huh? right. Li You're talking literally? figuratively. Is your mind blown? Is your mind well, blown? No, my mind no. ain't being literally blown. Literally means but that you actually do something. Don't use if you're gonna figure? be <laughs> Yes, you're talking figuratively. If okay. you're gonna be using and gonna be doing videos, yes, ma'am. You yes. Mean it. Okay. Got me looking but crazy. my mind like is blown. You, right. you supposed to be literally. Elementary. You need to go back to elementary if you can't get literally and figuratively. Wait, wait. No. Did, did your no. mind just get blown? No. Oh my God, baby, baby, don't worry about what I just said. You got good grammar. I'm sorry. Okay, so today we are talking about literally and figuratively. See. Literally basically means actually. Something actually happened or is being done. For some reason, we use this word to mean the complete opposite. Take for example, this lovely comment on my last video. What is up with this guy? He's not that smart. He literally got a muffin for brains. I literally have a muffin for brains? Well, Mr. Popsicle 229 Cream, I don't literally have muffin for brain. This up here, I got brain. I don't got muffin. You can't use the word literally. Literally means actually. So if you were saying this correctly, you're basically saying, I actually got a muffin for brain. Now, I figuratively may have a muffin for brain because sometimes my bra bra kaluni, my clock is cuckoo, I got screws loose. My noodles cock a doodle. But literally a muffin for brain? Muffin for brain? Come on, man. If you're gonna insult and make a comeback, at least make the grammar good. I don't know what the word literally means because I got a muffin for brain. I don't know. Oh, oh, muffin for brain. Oh. So unless you actually mean something in its actual context, you can't use the word literally. Like the sentence, I literally have a classroom of dogs. Now, I'm not just saying that. I actually have a classroom of dogs. Okay, class, repeat after me. We, the, it, he. Idiot. So yes, people, literally means actually, not exaggeration. So you can't say, Hey, I'm John Cena out there in the ring. Why can't you say that? Because you're not literally John Cena. You are you and I am I. Literally means actually. You're not John Cena, man. John Cena! Okay, so let's talk about figuratively. Because this is what most of us actually mean when we're using literally. See, figuratively is a figure of speech. It is a word or a phrase that is meant to be used in a non-literal manner. Like if I were to say to a really tall guy, Dude, you're a tree. I don't 
mean he's a tree. It's just a figure of speech, not meant to be taken in a literal sense. It's a metaphor, a word that is applied to an action or an object, but not meant to be taken seriously or literally. He is a tree. I said that because he had characteristics of a tree, meaning he's tall. He's tall as a tree, not literally a tree, figuratively a tree. So in closing, basically don't use literally unless you mean actually. Don't say sentences like this unless you actually mean them. <laughs> I literally died out laughing. <laughs> that was literally the best macaroni and cheese I ever tasted. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ugh, she just makes me so mad. I'm literally going to end up in jail over this. Coming to the end of our episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Literally enjoyed this. I hope you guys are literally crying out laughing right now. So I thank you guys for watching. As always, KIP, keep it positive. Literally and figuratively, it's elementary. Hey!